Hello everyone, I'm Trestic44 and welcome to this Let's Play of Heaven's Vault. Last episode, we did some walking around on Iox. Spoke with, I can't remember the guy's name, I keep forgetting it. I am horrible with names. And he told us of a library somewhere that he wants us to find. We have an idea of where it could be, we just need to actually find it. And we also found out that uh, Six has another mode that can be accessed. It was speaking in ancient, however, and we couldn't understand it, but we did get some, but he did manage to recover a word that he's going to point us to. Also, Six used to belong to Renba, apparently. Let's get off this rock. This way, mistress. And so we left the university. With new leads for a new site. Let's continue. Aboard the Nightingale. Is there any key to continue? There we go. I thought you were going to point somewhere out to me. Well, okay, I Oh, what the... Is that my gecko? Six, look, the gecko came with us. I am aware. How did the gecko come with us? I do not wish to talk about it, mistress. I'm guessing it was hidden inside you. <laughs> Alright, time to move on. I will ready the braces, mistress. Alright. So that's the side of the ancient library that we can't find. We've got an Age of Sail site and the Withering Palace there, but I want to go to this site. An eclectic series of artifacts, most notably Tappy's Curious Middle Sphere. Something from the Sage and Ages of Buried... Sh all right, I guess, and the sundial as well. Well, we can find it very easily, so I think we're going to try and find it. Why not? Sailing to an Age of Sail site. Onwards! Our route goes left, mistress. Indeed. Right. I'm not going to pass control to six because it wouldn't go very far before we're going into uncharted and unsailed waters. Like right here. Maybe a little further, but still. wonder what we'll find out there. I think perhaps we'll head left. We'll stick to the left. My Ari tried to stop me from sailing. She said it was dangerous. But I don't think she meant dangerous. I think she meant wrong. She's afraid of the rivers. Afraid of what all that space can do to you on the inside. further and we'll be taking uncharted waters. Okay, turn right. There is a new river to the right, which I believe will also reach our destination. You believe that, but we'll head left. I don't want to disappear into some tiny river and be lost. There are quite a few rivers to the west, on the way to the Withering Palace. I don't know 
what this age of sail site is. From Renba's dig sites, more shards of the Eyelight. Eh, we're not going there, though. Let's continue to this old site. Maybe we'll find something that'll narrow things down. Oh boy, rabbits? By the goddess and all her fi- By the goddess and all her fingers? Really? That's a unique one. Holy crap, this is a long one. Okay, I think we made it. Jeez, that went to far distance. And there's the site right there. Available data suggests the age of sail site is close at hand. Indeed. Looks like we missed a spot, but we do have an unexplored ruin over here. I think we can get to it. Yes, I see how we can get to it. Although, I think we can get to that one too. I want to get to all of these ruins. We are leaving the vicinity of the Age of Sail site, but we are close, and it's probably somewhat clear how to get to it. No, I, I know I missed the turning, but I did that intentionally, because I want to get around to this. an unexplored river to the right. Yeah, I know, but I'm going to go left because it looks like I'll be able to take this route to get to it. Slowly but surely, we will find our way to all of these ruins. Right? Yes, we are going right. That will take us to that bunch of ruins. Yes, we want to go right. Some say the rivers have a source, a single wellspring where they all begin. People love tidy explanations for things. Here we'll be able to get to it. Area of weaker flow, and to the right. Yes, there it is. Approach the ruin, we'll ask the question after. A ruin? I would guess it dates from the Age of Sail, mistress. Wait. I recovered a flute made of gold. I wonder how long it's been out there. I've seen the markings on this thing before, on the side of my ship. It has been inscribed, too. Ah, perfect! More inscriptions. There's a few words in this one. Uh, we have gives and all 
Mistress, I do not think you have enough information to read this. Most likely this comes from the same source as a chip devotional icon in the sky compass. Yes, we do have a lot of information. So we can make it to this one. I can see the route. I feel like we're sailing through a cloud. In effect, mistress, we are. The particles we can see are ice particles. Suspended in what is left of the river here. What is left? Are you saying this river is effectively dissolving? Here we go right. Turn us right shortly, mistress. The sparkles appear to be settled by our passing, mistress. We are sweeping them away as we sail. Alright, from here we turn right. Timor is always calling me a cleaner. This is a very particular kind of cleaning, mistress. The structure is barely intact, mistress. There is nothing here to find. Oh! Fine. Then I guess we're going to the eight. No! Stop that. We're going to here. I think we'll be able to reach the site relatively easily now. I didn't think the ship could move through fl flows this week. But it seems like whoever built the Nightingale knew what they were doing. Yes, I can see how we can get to the site. We're close. We are back within our search zone, Mistress. Which way? Six? To the right. Clearly. I do not know, mistress. Can you imagine trying to navigate this without a map? You could easily get lost. This is it. If there's something up ahead. We will need to hop her down, mistress. I believe I can see a viable surface. <clears throat> the spatial calculator Toppy gave me was fashioned here, I think. A single rocky peak was topped by a gleaming ruin. Well, uh... And what a jewel it was. Like a half-cut gemstone. This place is this place is falling apart. We could have arrived too late. Mistress, did you see that? Did something fall off? No, Mistress. I thought I saw... But no. It was nothing. You're seeing ghosts, Six. The dust is getting into your wiring. Might be possible to scramble up. No, 
mistress, one slip and you would be heading down rapidly. We'll look around a bit then. Come back this way if we get stuck. Thank you, mistress. Based on that, I will hopper you immediately as soon as you become even slightly stuck. <laughs> a walled city? It hardly seems large enough. These tiles are beautiful. No doubt Tappy will be interested, mistress. Indeed. Perhaps we'll hand it to him when we see him. This is indeed impressive. Do you think Tappy came here? Got the brass device from here? It seems unlikely, mistress. I do not believe Master Tappy likes to dirty his own hands. Wait here, Six. What a good idea, mistress. There. Definitely no way inside through here. This isn't a gate, really. It's a fence. But there's something caught in the metalwork here. An aged river map. Dating from the earliest days of the nebula? If there was any more wind, it would have blown away. It has been marked, mistress. As rivers... We have go and we have water, so flow makes sense. That's no, no. That's... I think as rivers flow, so do we. So if this line is due, that's good to know. That does make sense. As rivers flow, so do we. That will do for now. I think this comes from the same side as the chart. The one we found on Renbo's dig site. Having another artifact should be useful in tracking down where these things originated. This should help us locate it. Doesn't appear to be anything else here, though. You seem most important up there, mistress. Like an actor on a stage. Nothing hidden in this one. Although, the grill itself feels loose. If this was a city, it was a grand one. And a small one. It's more like a palace. Not gonna bash the grill with something. Let's see if we can find another way in. Oh, hold on. Is there a wellspring here? There must be mistress. There is plenty of air. Ah, symbols. Do you see? Traced into the plasterwork. Almost filled in with dust. Oh jeez, this is a long one. I know some of these words, I can guess the others. Still not sure about serpents. Okay, this is light and way. Do light way. I want to say opens. Opens its... We have wind over here, we have water, we have go. I want to say mouth, opens its mouth for you. We have place, many place, many people. Okay, this is people here. Is it serpents? I don't know. Of plant place rock. I don't know. Serpents something opens its mouth for you. City? Maybe that, no, that can't be Suns. Serpent City opens its mouth for you. 
I suppose it means welcome. There, mistress. Did you see? Surely even you saw that. What did you think you saw, Six? I thought I saw... I must have been mistaken. So is this supposed to be Serpent City, then? We can go around this way. We slipped around the corner of the great building, clinging to the narrowest of paths. The drop is precipitous. Have you ever heard of the Library of Future Knowledge? No, mistress. Wong mentioned a place called the Library of Future Knowledge. There's a break in the wall. Too high for you? Indeed, mistress. But I believe I have an alternative. Six? Where are you going? Well? Found anything? Nothing. I'll go by myself then. And for a moment, the sight seemed only quiet instead of empty. Like I might walk around a corner and find someone painting or reading or watching the sky. But, of course, there was no one here. Indeed. And when the emptiness came back, it was double. Something was removed from here. The sundial from the graveyard of the Emperor's perhaps. That would make sense. If this was a place for a sundial... It does make some sense. It's quite a view from here. You can see forever. All the way to the nebula's end. Six? Where are you, Six? Have you actually abandoned me this time? this place. And how did you get here, Shu? Did you hop? So ornate, so decorative. Ah, there's something under here. A sextant carved with a doorway design, dating from the earliest days of the nebula. Looks like there's an etched message on the casing. This is broken off. Oh, we have so many. Well, we have again at the end here. Uh, sail. No, your. Your makes. Jeez. Oh, your makes sense there. Back. Okay, there we are. There we go. I think back must be right. And again must be right, too. So, it's not quite Bless, or Goddess. Sail back your something again. Remember? Remember, sail back your... Okay, it's not Mother. Person, time, person, give, give time. Maybe it is mother. Remember, sail back your mother again? I don't know. I'd hazard that this comes from the same source as the map I found here before. 
This should help us work out where to look for the site of the ancient library of the loop. Oh, good. This one's just a crack ajar. But it's stuck. Rubble on the inside, perhaps. Where have you got to, Six? Did you go chasing your ghost? The pages are rotten through with this book. Still, it's not completely fallen to pieces. And there's some writing on the cover. This is the start of a fragment of text. Okay, we have fire here. Uh, under? I don't know. We have by. Not sure if that's actually fire. Fire and... We have me. I don't think that's under. Ah! I can add my translation for fire to my dictionary now. Let's see. Not rise. Let's see. Go below. Ah! Sit by fire and... Something me. Knowledge rise. Listen? No, read. I like that one. Sit... I could still change my mind, but... Sit by fire and read me. It has it that this comes from the same place as the sextant in the map. This should help us work out where to look for the site of the ancient library of the loop. Ah, uh, these are no better. So much moisture on this moon. Nothing paper could last. This place looks like Renaki. If Renaki was left to fall into ruin, that is. So Renaki may be ancient. Six did seem to come from this way. No way back to the Nightingale without Six, Elia. Perhaps you should have been nicer to it. Stay calm, Elia. Don't be dramatic now. Drawings. Not ancient for once, but just scribbles. That one looks like a robot with a flat head. Interesting. How is this here? How is this not rotting? Interesting. Here's more. Looks like a family. I wonder if these were drawn by a child. Curious. Where did these drawings come from? Anything up these stairs? Marks in the woodwork. This one is a fractured fragment from an even longer phrase. So we have us, garden, nebula, is... Okay, maybe it's not us. Ah! I was right! I think nebula must be right. I'm also convinced of garden. Nebula is... If that's we, I'm gonna say our. Nebula is our garden. <sighs> Locked. Nebula is our garden. Oh, what's this? This is a fragment of a statue fashioned from crystal. It looks like it dates from the Age of Sail. His body has been inscribed with characters in ancient script, too. Ah! This is broken off. Okay, I see your again. Love. And... I want to say this is and. And people. 
I'm certain my translation for love is right now. I'm sure of people, too. Something and love your people. So that's goddess. Pray? Pray and love your people? That makes sense. In fact, we have the symbol for goddess and we have speak. Do speak goddess. So that has to be pray. Pray and love your people. This comes from the same place as the model sliver and the fragment of sailcloth that I found on Renba's dig site. Presumably, people often travel to both the two places. This should make the site easier to find. Doesn't seem to be anything else up here, so back down we go. Good to know there's two layers levels to this place. The roof must be falling in every time the ground gives way. Luckily, luckily the dome is still holding. That's that way we bashed in. They're drawn in charcoal, I think. Should rub right off. Dancers, maybe? This gate clearly never opened. No hinges, no lock. The work of a child, most likely. Telling some kind of story, I suppose? But I can't make it out. A crumpled blanket. Thrown off when someone woke, then left here. This room can't have ever been someone's home, and it doesn't look much like a cell. Whoever slept here made a fire. They burned old chairs, boxes, floorboards. Surely it's not... No. I wondered if it was still warm, but of course it isn't. Someone camped in this room after this place was abandoned. That'll be whoever ate the fruit. Someone was sleeping here recently. I wonder where they went. And did they have a ship? But the paintings are strange. They suggest that someone was here for some time. Very strange. Ah. Something written above the door. Very short and simple. This is the end of a line of text. Open. Oh. Okay. I can add my translation for open to my dictionary now. Life play home. Open home house. Open house? Does open house work? It's like it's been chewed. Did it fall away brick by brick? Did it all collapse at once? Clearly this is the end. We can't go any further this way. And now that I look at the time, this episode has to end here. Because it's gone on long enough. Hopefully Six will show up again soon. This is a very interesting place. Next episode, we'll continue looking through this place. I am very curious about what we'll find. That'll be in the next episode. So, until then, I'm Chester44. That is Aaliyah. Six must be somewhere. This has been a Let's Play of Heaven's Vault. And I shall see you all next time.